Hey guys, welcome back. Today, we're fighting yellow jackets in my wall. That's right. They're in the wall. I can't get them out. Can't spray them with bee spray because apparently they're up in the corner here. So we have to resort to other means of getting rid of them. I have an idea that I got from a friend. So we're going to give it a shot and see how it goes. All right, so the plan is to take this blow gun and then this hose and seven dust. What you do is you put the seven dust inside the hose. This hose had the end cut off of it, so it acted like a little bit more of a scoop. I found it to be a little bit easier than trying to just get it in normally. So yeah, you just load up the hose to however much seven dust you want in there. And you uh, hook up the hose to the air gun and let her go. So I did two practice runs with this setup to mostly just try to find out how much dust I needed to put in the line before I shot in the wall and found out that I didn't put enough in. Also trying to figure out how to hold the end of the hose onto the blow gun was a bit tricky but with a little patience I got it figured out and by patience I mean I use duct tape Here you can see this yellow jacket's covered in seven dust, but he's still kicking. Just crawls out there and flies away. So I let this record for about 20 minutes, and as you can see, these bees appear to be not affected by the seven dust at all. So I loaded up and shot him again with a little bit more seven dust this time. I let this record for about another 15 or 20 minutes, and as you can see, this is still a very active hive site, so I wasn't sure what I was going to do with it. So I decided after dark I was going to hit it again. So this is the third time I've hit it. And as you can see, it every time it goes up into that corner, so it should be getting onto that hive just perfect. And this is a quick look inside the hose. This is what I shot in during the night. Great news is, come morning, the bees were gone. And I'm not sure if they died in the wall or if they just packed up shop and left. But they're not in the wall anymore. They're no longer my problem. So I got to paint it without getting stung. If you guys decide to go this method, make sure you wear some protective clothing. That way you wear your hands up there. You're not getting stung. Be smart, stay safe, and don't get hurt. Good luck.